Well, Governor Roy Cooper and state health officials are issuing some new guidance tonight on how to protect yourself against the Omicron variant. News Channel 12 Shantia Hudson is joining us tonight in Jacksonville, where she is live to break down how you can stay safe. And Shantia, what are local doctors telling you? As coronavirus cases start to surge, Dr. Mandy Cohen is urging people to get vaccinated, boosted, test, and even wear masks in some public places. The newest variant of COVID-19, Omicron, is the most contagious we've seen yet and will likely set record high daily case numbers in the coming weeks. A stark warning from Governor Roy Cooper's office and state health officials for people to act fast to stay safe as cases surge in North Carolina. Evidence suggests that it is two to three times as contagious as the Delta variant, making it four to six times as contagious as the original COVID-19 virus. With Christmas just days away, local health leaders are preparing for the surge to get worse. We expect, obviously, uh, Delta waves continue for the next couple weeks. Omicron is going to take that over very quickly in about three, four weeks where it's going to be more dominant. And then with the flu season, this is peak flu season time. With all three of them hitting at the same time, we're expecting a very, very rough year. Dr. Aaron Paramzidian heads COVID-19 testing, vaccination, and treatment efforts in 29 counties across North Carolina and says vaccinations are the strongest defense against the variant. So if you've only had one dose, obviously you don't have much protection, but it's still better than nothing. If you've had two doses, it's about 40% protection. With the three doses, it goes back up to 70, 80% protection. Dr. Piram Zidian adds for more protection, people should take extra precautions to protect hospital capacity with the already exhausted systems. Even if you don't believe that this is gonna be serious, add on more sick patients to that already taxed healthcare system, and it is going to break. Those extra precautions are ones Dr. Cohen outlines in a secretarial advisory. Everyone can help protect hospital capacity by following the guidance outlined by Secretary Cohen. Vaccinate, boost, test, and mask. Dr. Mandy Cohen also recommends guidelines for holiday travel. She says that you should only travel if you've been fully vaccinated for COVID-19 and the flu. She also adds that people should get tested before going to indoor gatherings with people outside of their home. For more information on the advisory, you can visit our website, WCTI12.com. In Jacksonville, I'm Shantia Hudson for News Channel 12.